All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel again. Thank you all so much for coming over. We're back on the Beardy channel, Bruce Lee Central. Uh, Bolo challenges Bruce Lee's speed. Then this happened. If you guys don't know who Bolo is, it's a big old buff dude from that, uh, what was that? Was it Enter the Dragon? I think that was the name of the movie. I don't know, but we I want to check this out. I don't remember him being in anything else. Bolo. I'm trying to think, was he in any other movie? All right. I'll leave the link to their channel in the description so you guys can check out more. We ain't gonna waste no more time. Let's jump right into it. Welcome to Beardy, Bruce Lee Central. Hey everybody, it's Birdie here. What's going on, guys? There he is. Okay, so remember when Samu Hung challenged Bruce Lee's speed? I remember the first time I met Bruce Lee. Uh, uh, that time he's not... He's he not study uh, shooting in Hong Kong. He just come visit in Hong Kong, you know. He come to my set. I met an action choreographer at that time. And, the, and then he, somebody in, introduced him for me. Oh, this Bruce Lee, the same home, blah, 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 blah. I said, oh, hello, hello. And then I said, are you really fast? Then he asked me, what do you mean? I said, hmm, what do you mean? They said, you want to try? I said, not bad, okay. Then we try. Then we try. Then we hold him there. We're standing there. Then I try to kick him. I try to start to kick him. My kick just go to the halfway, and he he fit already on my face. <laughs> like that. I'm just like that. Then, what do you say? I said, you're really fast. <laughs> oh, it's very fast. Well, that didn't end well for Samo Hung. And after this incident, Samo was telling everyone in the Hong Kong movie scene about Bruce Lee's amazing speed. And eventually... I tell you, man, it's like you... You watch these movies and they do, do such a great job acting. Like, you think that they have real beef with each other, like Chuck Norris and stuff like that. Like, that, it took me a while. Like, I was so young watching that movie. I thought it was real when Bruce Lee beat up Chuck Lee. I mean, uh, Chuck Norris. I said Chuck Lee. Chuck Norris. Um, so, just hearing him talk. And then knowing what the movie showed, you know, because that scene, that dude was like, I was like, uh oh, this is cool, though. It became a mythical thing. It became a thing of legend. You know, even in the early 70s, Bruce Lee was regarded to be the fastest human being on planet Earth. So the rumor spread and Bolo Young eventually heard about Bruce Lee's amazing speed. So when Bolo Young was lucky enough to work with Bruce Lee on Enter the Dragon, he yeah. just had to test Bruce Lee's speed. So remember that Bolo Young and Bruce Lee had a fight scene originally on the movie Enter the Dragon, but it was taken out of the script. For what reason? We don't know. We simply don't know. But one day, Bruce Lee goes to Bolo Young and he says, Bolo, I'm sorry, man. But we have to remove the scene uh, with you and me having a fight in the movie Enter the Dragon. So obviously Bolo was very disappointed. Not only because he wouldn't have a fight scene with Bruce Lee in the movie. But he wanted to test Bruce Lee, right? He wanted to spar with Bruce Lee. He wanted to test his speed. So Bolo said, okay, that's fine. But... I'm not going to be having a fight with you in the movie Enter the Dragon, but at least let's have a sparring match. I want to test your speed. And Bruce Lee is amused and he says, okay, let's do it. And they start talking. That's what you're seeing right here. They start talking and like arguing about how they're going to do it. And look at Bolo Young. He's so confident and calm. I love that guy. <laughs> I really do. He's so confident and calm and he knew that I'm fast, okay? I'm fast, I'm strong, I'm built like a bodybuilder. I can yeah. handle this. That's what he said to himself, right? So Bruce Lee was telling him, okay, let's get comf comfortable, let's take our clothes off. And he was telling Bolo what's going to happen. So I'm going to punch you, right? And your goal is to dodge or block my punch. That's all you have to do. Dodge it or block it. If you dodge it or no. block it, you win. It's that simple, okay? And no that's way. exactly what they did. They took their clothes off 
And that's what you're seeing right here. Bruce Lee landing a punch on Bolo Young's face. So Bolo Young was not able to block or dodge Bruce Lee's punch. Of course not. And he ended up suffering a, a punch to the face, as you're seeing right here. So obviously Bolo Young was fine. Bruce Lee wasn't going all out or anything. This was just to demonstrate his speed. And Bolo Young, he just... Actually, he was happy after this instant. <laughs> he was happy that he got to taste like a fraction of Bruce Lee's speed, you know? So we know that these two guys had a bunch of sparring <laughs> matches during the filming of Enter the Dragon. They even had a couple of real fights during the filming of Enter the Dragon. But this is a real cool one. Uh, the footage that you're seeing here, the pictures here, they were thought to be lost forever. And I managed to obtain them and I'm sharing them with your guys right now. So thank you guys for watching. See you guys later. Bye. That's pretty cool, man. Because, you know, like I said... It's a lot of stuff, especially when you think about fighting movies, man. I know a lot of challenges be happening, you know, because um, even even like in sports movies, they say a lot of these dudes like to be playing like one on one or just just stuff like that. So um, it's always competition. Like like look at Deion Sanders. Every time he gets an interview with another football player especially like chad johnson he always want to line up with him like he's guarding him so yeah i i i can definitely see people like doing like is it true like is it are you really that fast as they say you are like show me show me like no nah, it's just a movie y'all just acting it's not real and then once you hit that speed you know he's like all right block it and it's like and you're like, oh, <laughs> uh, that's good, though. I love this these type of videos, man. Appreciate you guys coming over and watching. Um, hope you all enjoy. I just feel like whenever, you know, I get the chance to watch something on Bruce Lee, man. Like I said, I got that tattoo, man. So, yeah, this is an iconic legend. Oh, man, gone way too soon. Way too soon. All right. Peace out.